Welcome back to the channel. Hope everyone's having a good day. Today I'm going to go over a project that I've covered before on my channel. Now I'm very excited to say I am working with this team. The project is Optimus AI. So they might sound familiar to you. I covered them around six weeks ago. Right here I did this video. Essentially I was just looking at projects in the AI space. I knew that that sector was going to become very trendy in crypto and this project really stood apart in a crowded, crowded space. Basically their marketing was what caught my attention. They're their character, their brand, their image was just very consistent. They knew exactly what they were. I get a lot of other projects where they'll have like a dog name, but then the utility, the platform is completely unrelated. The market's all over the place. Not this coin. They know what they are, and their brand has been consistent from the start. Their voice, you can say. So that's what caught my attention. Now they've been trading on exchanges for about a month and a half. They've done pretty well. We'll get to that in a second. Here's the website, OptimusBot.io. So make sure you're on the right one, not OptimusIO.com, OptimusBot.io. There's a bunch of different Optimus coins as well. So again, make sure you're on the right one. Ticker symbol Opti, $33 million market cap. So it's kind of getting towards the medium market cap size right now. And here's a Twitter page right here, Optimus AI token. So what is it exactly? Well, it's a meme coin, essentially. It's a cryptocurrency project made to support and honor Elon Musk's robot friend, Optimus. So you may or may not know, but Elon, he's obviously big into robots, and he has a pet robot that he debuted at a company sort of trade show here, company fashion show, and the pet robot is called Optimus. There it is in action. So essentially, whatever Elon is into and whatever Elon is talking about, that becomes trendy in crypto. And you may or may not know, but with Artificial Intelligence Day, AI Day coming up September 30th. You can be sure that Elon's going to be talking about AI, robots, and hopefully Optimus as well. Quite a bit going into that. It's going to be a lot of exposure brought onto this project. Very savvy team to see the sort of newer holiday coming up on the horizon. Some more about the project. So it's a decentralized currency. It's fully community run. It's a goal of building and fostering the largest AI community while helping to provide exposure and resources to some of the innovations. A portion of the taxes will go directly into the Optimus Venture Fund, and with the community at the center, developers can apply for small grants and seed rounds. Once projects have been selected, they'll have access to the pool of our massive community members. So basically, the buy and sell tax is 3% buy, 3% sell. That's not bad. A lot of the other projects I cover, newer ones, it's a 5 to 10%. Buy and sell tax, 3% isn't really that bad at all. So a portion of those buy and sell taxes go into the Optimus Venture Fund. And then the team will use the Optim Optimus Venture Fund to select projects in their ecosystem to get some of that money to sort of further their marketing and further their own goals. So obviously, they haven't really gone over what the criteria is to get the investor money, but it's safe to assume your project probably has to be about artificial intelligence, has to probably fit in with the Optimus ecosystem. They have something to do with Elon Musk, all that sort of stuff right there. So it's sort of like a venture capital kind of project. We've seen a bunch of these, like Colt Dow is kind of like this as well. What else? So obviously Optimus is the main robot, the male robot, but there, that's not the only character. There's Opti Girl, Optimus's girlfriend. It's a female robot right there. And then you can also design your own robot using the Tesla AI image generator. Very cool, very cool. So let's look at the price action here. So as I mentioned, $36 million market cap, right around 500 on coinmarketcap.com. All the coins are fully vested. This isn't like a big VC to token that's taken a bunch of pre-sale money, et cetera, and coins are going to become slowly invested. Not like that at all. All the coins are fully out there. It's fully community run, so you don't need to worry about unlock times coming up in the future. So... March 7th, it hit exchanges. Now, it's been sort of up and down since then. It's found some good support right here, so it hasn't really gone below the 30 cent level. Obviously, you know, this uh, this chart isn't really that bad. I see some spikes. That's good. You want to be, you know, you want the, a coin to become trendy and get some trader attention at some point here. It shows the team knows how to put out announcements, knows how to make developments, etc. You just don't want to see it kind of flat and trailing off. So this pump right here was last week. This coincided with Petabyte's arrival right here. So you may or may not heard, but this guy, they now have the team announced that Petabyte, he runs Petabyte Capital. He is joining as senior advisor to the project. So you maybe haven't heard of him. He's kind of low key like me, but he's a big name. Look at this co founder of Floki, the Floki that I cover a lot on my channel that went up over 600% in February in a parabolic run, making it in the top three or four best performing coins in all the top 500 of the year so far, pretty much. So. The Floki name is just goal, and this was the guy who essentially ran his co-founder Floki, and he was the guy who was essentially solely running it when it had that parabolic run. So this guy knows 
how to do it. So, you know, obviously people are in the know, they've heard of him. So when the team announced that this guy's coming on as a senior advisor, that caused this coin Optimus to go up big time last week. Right there, it's pulled back slightly, but now it's back up a little bit today. It's close to the 40 cent level. So what else going on? And then also, so Peter has been very active in the community so far. He put up this thread a few days ago, right after he was announced as senior advisor. Basically, just kind of the strategic plan for the coin, how they plan on leveraging Elon's interest in robots and the Optimus name and all that. This thread got a million views. So he has a pretty decent sized following, 50,000. It's not like millions of followers, but 50,000 is still pretty good. But still, a million views for a thread, people are paying attention. So this is exciting, very exciting. Obviously, the project's been getting a lot of other traction too. So currently they actually have six exchanges already some big ones gates mxc bitmart l bank and BitGets. there it is right there so this is about perfect it shows the team is well funded if you get on big exchanges in the beginning a lot of times you have to pay for it so the team has the capital they have the funds it's very important for marketing too and this is also good because obviously nothing pumps a coin more than a top 10 exchange listing so how do the top 10 exchanges decide what coins to list they look at what the you know, exchanges 11 through 20 or 20 through 30 are listing. And BitGet, Gate, MexC, L Bank, those are a lot of exchanges between like 5 and 15 or 10 and 15. The fact they listed it, the top 10 exchanges that are, have not listed it yet, they are noticing. So the potential for a lot of future mega announcements with exchanges that will hopefully cause price appreciation. This is one of the most important factors I look at with the coin just to see how much uh, upward potential there is going forward. They also have done a bunch of big giveaways here. So I'm sure you see a lot of teams do $100, $500 giveaways here. No, $25,000 giveaway. So this coin is well funded. When you have the Floki founder, you know, uh, involved, you're going to have funds. Very important. Very important. It's top trending on CoinGecko last week. It was the most viewed coin in CoinMarketCap. So most viewed coin on CoinMarketCap last week when they announced Peter Byte was coming. Very impressive. It was the top trending coin in the U.S. and U.K. specifically. So very sort of narrow base here. So it hasn't really hit the Asia regions yet. Big in the U.S. and U.K. Here it is in CoinMarketCap when it was number one. They've also gotten up to 6,000 holders as well. So that's pretty good. A lot of the coins I cover on my channel that have been around maybe a year and a half, two years at the most, they're at 50,000 holders. So this coin's been around two months, already at 6,000 holders. That's, you know, that's on pace to be over 100,000, maybe 150,000 by the two year mark. So that is a very, very good amount of traction so far. They've also got some other big names involved Crypto Banter. This guy here, probably recognize him, Ran Nooner. He's involved, believes. I know this guy here, believes crypto. I know him from the Vault community. He's involved as well. They also did a partnership with OKX, a web wallet partnership. Very exciting. If you look at the roadmap here, basically just continue the marketing, get on more exchanges, onboard a lot of specialists in the field of AI development, generate a lot of memes, uh, Elon AI related memes. That's you know pretty much what crypto Twitter is about, just memes. So that's what I like to see. That's it. So anyways, drop a comment down below. You obviously, you'll be hearing a lot more about this video since I am working with the team. Very excited about that. And I'm very personally bullish about this coin myself. I really like the robot theme. I think it can really sort of catch on. Uh, I'm excited to see where it goes. Ben Crypto signing out. Be back tomorrow with a new video. Catch you later.